Hello, this is Matthew with Technomicon Media, and this week's Game Tech article and video is for Star Wars The Old Republic rating, and um, in Star Wars The Old Republic, rating is actually called Ops, uh, short for Operations. An Ops group in The Old Republic is a group larger than the standard party size, so it's um, standard party size is four players, and then you can have... Um, for, for raid purposes, an 8 or a 16 man ops, but ops groups I think can go up to 40 man if you're just doing like outdoor world bosses or PvP or whatnot. So this is Eternity Vault. This is the, the main, the, the first raid in the Old Republic, and this is the last boss. This is Soa, and just wanted to give you guys kind of a glimpse of what the fight's about. It's really cool. There's um, obviously a lot of platforming, literally. So part of the fight is, is simply just jumping down and navigating and waiting on platforms and you know because you take a lot of fall damage in this fight so you want to minimize that by not jumping too far down if you can help it and um, so you can see us navigating down taking out these little energy crystals and then moving on to the next sort of phase of Soa. In this phase of, of the fight Soa gains a new ability where he can prison a member of your party in these little these little crystal pylons you'll see me attack right now and as well as he will toss various members of the party up in the air and they'll spin around and be out of the fight until until they land so that's that's really this this phase in the fight in a nutshell and I just thought it was really cool to share the, um, the intricacies of, of what the Old Republic has available for players that want to get into raiding and all in all, from what I've seen, the um, raid content's pretty well developed for, for the game only being a couple months old now. Um, they've already added in um, another raid, Karaga's Palace. Uh, well, they, they added in more content in that as well as um, having a lot more raid content you know, scheduled you know, for, for, I think, probably May-ish you know, from what I read in the developer's notes. But um, yeah, this is, this is raid content. Uh, ops content in the Old Republic uh, Soa fight and our first kill and uh, just for players wondering this is a two time speed the fight's pretty long it's eight eight or nine minutes we finished this in about eight minutes this was our first kill and it's a pretty clean kill only one person died and they, they died when uh, Soa knocked down the, the platform on the second kind of phase of, of that but we res them down at the bottom so just a uh, showing off a little bit more of the fight and talking a little bit more about it you can see us kind of you know stranded on this platform waiting for for a close one to come so that we don't all die from fall damage which we've done a lot of the times the the fight seemed to have been pretty buggy in the past and certain platforms just would never fall and we'd end up just you know all falling to our deaths but here we make it pretty much unscathed we res up the guy and here's the last phase which is more of the same in a sense that you still need to kill pylons but so and now shields himself so the the tank you know which isn't me i'm the off tank again which for this fight really isn't needed and um, you just bring him over he takes some damage, loses a shield, you just nuke him for a little bit and then back on pylon duty. And here I'm actually inside the pylon, I'm the one trapped this time, you can see how that looks. And after multiple times getting this uh, sort of you know, shield versus unshielded phase down, you, that's pretty much how, how you end up killing Soa. You just you know keep people out of the, the pylons because if you don't stay on top of that it just gets you know more difficult to, to bring them down if you have multiple players trapped at the same time because you're losing you know DPS or heals. We've actually had tanks pylon before. I'm not sure if that was a, a bug or if that's working as intended. That's that's sort of why I stay in, in my tank gear for this in case the, the tank somehow gets pylon and they need me to pick them up. But uh, anyhow, so there's the fight. You can see Soa getting brought down.